Hey guys, it's Carrie, your friendly neighborhood makerspace librarian, back with another science short. And today we're going to be looking at chemical reactions, specifically how things change when they are put together with an acid or a base. Uh, acids like lemon juice and base is things like baking soda. And specifically, the chemical reaction we're going to see today is going to let us make green eggs without using any food coloring. So the first thing we need is some red cabbage. And we're going to use red cabbage because unlike green cabbage, red cabbage has something called anthocyanins. And that is what, when it mixes with another liquid, it will tell us if it is an acid or a base. So we're going to cut up these pieces of red cabbage we're gonna put them in some boiling water for about 10 minutes. And then we're gonna use that water as our indicator. So when we mix our indicator with something that is acidic, like vinegar or lemon juice, it's going to turn a bright pink or red color. And when we mix our indicator with something that is a base, it will turn green. So we're gonna take this cabbage we are going to put it in our boiling water and it's gonna produce a real dark purple, kind of thick liquid. And that liquid is going to be our indicator. And while that is simmering, we're gonna get ready for the next bit of our experiment, which is going to need egg white. So I'm going to take a regular egg and I'm going to separate the yellow yolk from the clear egg white. Almost got it all separated here. There we go. So here in the middle we have our cabbage water indicator. You can see it's kind of that dark purple. And the first thing we're going to do is we are going to add it to some lemon juice, which I have in this vial. And after we add it, you can see that it turns bright pink almost immediately, indicating to us that what we had in that vial was an acid. So now we are going to take some of it and mix it with our pretty clear egg white. Here we go. And I will use my spatula to stir a little bit. And you can see that almost immediately it starts to turn kind of a blue green color, indicating that we have a base. I'm going to add a little more, stir it up. You can tell that is definitely green. Now the final step, we've got our warm pan here and we are going to put the green egg whites in there. We're going to cook ourselves an egg. I'm going to add the yellow yolk back into my egg whites so it's like a real fried egg. And it won't really taste any different. It just looks a little crazy to have this kind of bright green, blue, teal fried egg. All right, I think we are about ready. Mix that in. And don't judge me on my egg flipping because I'm not super great at it. But there you go. That is how we're using the magic of science to get a green fried egg. And there you have it, green eggs, no food coloring. So thanks for following along. I hope to see you back next week when we will be back with another science short.